Mac and cheese, meatballs, and more were served up at the Energy Event Center in Lansing. Instead of concert goers, the place was filled with the young and old sharing a plate of Thanksgiving food. Passion is for people. I'm a people person. Always have been and always will be. This right here is just, this is a purpose. Even though venue owner Ryan Cabell lives in Flint, he calls Lansing his second home. That second home has been the site of hardship. In July, five people were shot in the Logan Square parking lot, just feet from the event center that was packed with the concert. The investigation led city officials to call for the revocation of the venue's cabaret license, keeping it from hosting dancing or live entertainment while serving food, alcohol, or merchandise. Losing the license in September, Cabell says he has hosted a few private events but wanted to use his space to help those struggling this holiday. When I said that I wanted to do something for the community, the less fortunate and the homeless, that's all that I thought about. It's something that community organizers are thankful for. Like I'm getting goosebumps right now because I did have someone call me, you know, like I don't have anything to do on Thanksgiving. And I was like, well, I know what we're going to do then. It's kind of testament to the fact that he cares with the amount of effort that has been put mm -hmm. into the event. Cabell says well more than 100 plates were served. As to if he's worried the event would cause issues with city leaders, he says helping others is his focus. And it smiles on people's face. That's all that matters. I'm not going to stop being a good person, having a kind heart, because of one trial.